Steve, great result tonight. Uh, well taken goal by Newts. All positives tonight? Yeah, very much so. I think we, we sort of carried on from Saturday, especially the second half, uh, against all the elements. Um, we took that performance into tonight. And after a slight change in shape and not being able to train, uh, we've got some very intelligent footballers and they, they took on board the instruction. And I think from the first minute, we started off really well. Um, although there was a couple of chances in the first five minutes where you're thinking, oh, that doesn't look good. Uh, we weathered those two chances. I think we controlled the game for large parts and um, typical us, we've had numerous chances that we could have put the game to bed. We haven't done. We've then ended up taking a chance with uh, a centre-half combination of a 1-2 and uh, it's fell to Sean Newton who scores an absolute belter for us. Um, really composed uh, and I think from that minute we, we started to open them up even more then. We looked like we were trying to get the second and third and you know we were the only team that really wanted to try and play the game in the right way. Um, they were time wasting from the first minute of the game, which was really frustrating. Um, the referee allowed it to happen, and you think, is it going to be one of them nights? But we came through it. And at this stage of the season, people say it's just about points, but for us, there is a, a performance level that we expect. And I thought for 90 minutes, the performance level was there from the majority of the team uh, for the whole game, and uh, we thoroughly deserved the three points. As you say, obviously, we've got to know the, uh, the goal. Um, Dan Cowan to, to Sean Newton um, but Sean Newton although the, the, the great goal um, he was the bid pass man of the match this, this evening um, looked really assured composed good on the ball strong in the air um, is that pleasing for you a player coming in and settling so quickly and, and, and just gelling with the lads yeah very much so I mean, we, we, we explained why we brought Sean to the club and John's wealth of experience and quality um, and the levels above can only aid us in what we're trying to do this year and um, it's been nothing but positive since he come in. His attitude on Saturday, even from the sideline, was brilliant. Um, I spoke to him earlier today, told him he was going to be playing and he, he was like a kid in a sweet shop and his performance level tonight was superb. Even from his very first header in the first minute of the game, was just commanding and he was composed. And, um, you know, we, I'd like to think all the players that we brought in, you look at even like Sir Dom Terry, who's only came on loan and he's carried on scoring in the league above, all have made good contributions. And uh, I'm just really pleased for, for Sean on his, his first home debut of starting. Uh, he gets an MOM and uh, a, a goal that goes and wins us three points. But, you know, it wasn't just um, Sean uh, that's got us the win. I, I've got to say that I thought all round we played fantastic. And it's nice to get that clean sheet as well. Uh, pleased for Theo, he's been like a a bear with a sore backside for the last few weeks because he takes it personal if we don't get them clean sheets uh, and, it, and it's hurt us so clean sheet three points new signing getting man at match and a goal it, it's worked out perfect now especially with the uh, the results that are in and around us which probably hypes up the, the victory of what it actually is but at the end of the day it's just three points and we move on to the next one and i think obviously touching on that um Newt's celebration and the celebration at the end with the fans and and you know the the feeling the atmosphere around the tarmac Sylvan Stadium. Does it feel like the lads have got their sort of mojo back, the confidence and that sort of air of and belief that they're going into games now with with that belief that we're going to win games of football. Yeah, I mean we've just took seven out of nine points. Um, you know you, you hear comments and opinions about people who watch it. And I get that, that's football, um, you know, when you look at the performances and the losses, I don't know how we lost a game against Morpeth uh, 3-0, we played better against Morpeth than we did South Shield and maybe tonight, and we lost 3-0, so we always know the performance levels are there, the one thing this team does is create chances, and I feel like when you're in a bad run you're looking for that bit of character, and I think we, we turned the table when we played Warrington here, uh, and we had to come back from uh, behind three times to, you know, to get a point, and I think that's shown the character there and again on Saturday against South Shields um, behind twice and, and still finished the game strong and I thought we should have won the game um, and then you look at the celebration and even though there's two or three new players in there there's a, a togetherness now that obviously a victory always does that and I feel like Saturday was a bit of a victory for us even though it was a draw uh, and the celebration as a manager when you see your players do that it, it just it just shows what you've got and, and then the celebration at the end with me as well with the players it, it's it's only three points and we're not going to get above our station but it, it means a lot to us we're working hard to, to produce performances that the fans can be happy with and get results and chase the top two and um, at the moment uh, we've done that um, 
really well in the last two, three games and we've just got to make sure we don't get too high and uh, we don't take it for granted. Anyone can beat anyone in this league and we've seen that over the last few weeks, us more so than others. So yeah, it's one to enjoy, um, but tomorrow we'll switch on and uh, our attention goes to, to now which on Saturday. And as you say and alluded to there, um, obviously games come thick and fast in this, in this league, on the road again Saturday. Um, is it important that your side now just carries that belief on and, and get things right for that game? Yeah, uh, bounce wins in this league are really important. Uh, we talked about Saturday being a great point as long as we won tonight. Uh, we've done that, so it's a great point Saturday. Um, if we can go and take uh, a victory on Saturday, um, it just then shows away from home. Um, we've then taken 10 points out of 12 and we're very much a form team uh, and we're picking up form at the right time when maybe some others aren't. Every team goes through it. Uh, we've gone through it. We've come through the other end together. And um, yeah, we've just got to go there, do the job, be professional. Uh, we'll patch up a little bit on Thursday because we're still carrying knocks here, there and everywhere. Ben Turner's come off again today injured. Feel so sorry for him. Um, Foxy's had little niggles. Um, Mackenzie Heaney, new Sandy, he's got a niggle. So we've just got to patch people up. Well, then we'll turn up on Saturday. Uh, we'll have a good following. So, you know, I do wish all the, the travelling support safe travels and thank them for the support in advance. And we've just got to go there and do the job. And um, if we perform, uh, we've got a great chance of taking three points. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Obviously, well done tonight and uh, good luck Saturday. Cheers, mate. Ta